it's big, beautiful, escapist entertainment. But like the other movies, it wears its heart very much on its sleeve. Usually around the holidays is when I like bring out the ones I've already seen five times and rewatch them while I wrap gifts. So some of my favorites are Love Actually. Also Elf, a classic I love to watch. For me, yearly watches would be The Crow, Deer Hunter, <laughs> which I'm sure. It's true, it's true, that's the, that's the truth. Every year? Uh, yeah, I watch it every single, at least once a year. Uh, Heat would be there too, and Tombstone. That's another constant rewatch. Wow, yeah. those are dark rewatches. <laughs> yes, they are. Oh, I just watched A Star Is Born at home. Nice. Yeah. What did we just watch? Well, I watched Destroyer with Nicole Kidman. Very good film. Movie night at home, well, I mean, warm blanket always, cozy blanket. And I love popcorn, but my favorite kind of popcorn is the kind with M&Ms and Sour Patch Kids in it. Yeah, fair enough. For me, go-tos go would definitely be, I actually i am one of the few people that loves black licorice, so yeah, you know. a lot of, lot of black licorice, a lot of toffee. And then I usually, I'll usually go through like three quarters of a box of cereal during a movie too. So that's a big one for me. I love making ups. Uh, I, ever since I was a kid, I was like always super nerdy about how they made stuff. So seeing how, how a movie, how they did something that I thought was really cool, seeing how they did it, my favorite thing in the world. I love a good gag reel. Before DVDs were ubiquitous, it, you know, it, I always like waited to the end of the, of the credits just in case they yeah. were gonna throw in a gag reel. That's true. It was always so fun to see like the fourth wall be broken and see like these characters just become real people. I particularly love that Dragons has always been big and epic, but there are also small funny moments and tender moments, and it just feels like there's something for, for everyone. Number one, I think it's a good story, but I also think there's a, a lot of stuff kids can learn from it and enough spectacle to keep the adults interested too.